This is a tale of two promises. Here's the first. So I am announcing now on the steps of Downing Street that we will fix the crisis in social care once and for all with a clear plan we have prepared. And here's the second. We can do all these things without raising our income tax, VAT or national insurance contributions. That's our guarantee. Now it looks like something's got to give. Roughly £10 billion a year is the figure pencilled in to fix the social care crisis. A 1% rise in national insurance contributions would cover that. And there's growing speculation that's what's coming. Was a minister hinting at it today? All of us, inevitably, at some stage, are going to be elderly. And therefore, this is an intergenerational issue. And that means that all of us uh, have a responsibility to show to some of that uh, uh, burden uh, and that particular obligation. But all of us making a contribution to some sounds unfair on a younger generation who may end up paying more tax to help older people, some of whom may be better off. Particularly people receiving pensions who are higher rate taxpayers, many of them will not be paying national insurance contributions. I think many of them would agree that that isn't fair. So what do we think, fair or not? It's part and parcel, we only get older, so eventually, you know, we pass it down, we, everyone inherits. You know, you've got to put it in to get out. I know there is kind of grievances among younger people of paying high tax and finding it hard to get on, you know, a property ladder. It's social care at the end of it, yeah, isn't it? It's, yeah, social care at the end of it. That's it, if it was for something a bit trivia, then no. But it's one of them ones. If it's something for good, then we've got to do our bit, haven't we? There's got to be another way, rather than penalising the, the working man or woman again. It will either be the tax or go up from national insurance, even one of the two. You think yeah. it's going to come from somewhere? Oh, yeah. Of okay. course, yeah. Right. <laughs> to pay for this, there is a bill coming. We just don't know yet exactly what it will look like. Andy Bell, 5 News.